All it displayed was <laughs> your depraved imagination. <laughs> But that's what made it so fun is because it wasn't like if we choose super negative, there's a crash and everybody dies. It's mm -hmm. they find a used prophylactic on the cuddle <laughs> wheel and then there's this huge scandal in the little town. <laughs> like, who thinks that way? Oh, wait, my partner does. <laughs> Hey everyone, it's Mass Bandit here with episode 16 of Planet Bro Coaster, and with me as always is my partner in crime, N7, or Mike. Yep, that's me. Yep, hi. Hi. How you doing today? I am, uh, you know, not as excited, because it's not Ryan's week. I know, well, you know what, to be fair, that was how many episodes ago now, we kind of got to stop talking about it. That's and we're going to have to start pimping our next guest soon. And then our that's guest true. after that. We are already Whoa. two guests, well, maybe. We know when one is going to come. We it's don't yes. know when the other is going to come. Um, no, no but comment on any of no that. No comment. Yeah. Because that's dirty. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it, John. <laughs> Why are you going to make things so, so I'm sorry, PG-13? That's, like... <laughs> that's some low-hanging fruit. Oh, straight to the point. Well, it's my build week. It was my build week. Actually, build weeks. I don't think we said this yet. Two weeks uh, per build week. Too far down the road. We don't want to be like a month ahead. I know, every time. What the hell episode is this? So it's, it, it, I've had the park for two weeks, and this is the first time I actually feel real confident about um, well, most of what I've built. Um, okay. a, a, and, well, you've helped. Helped. <laughs> <laughs> You've you've in, you've influenced the biggest part of what I've built, and actually, what's funny is the biggest part of what I've built is the most unfinished part of what I've built. <clears throat> no shit, huh? Yeah, it's, 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 it's <laughs> Once hard. I touch things, you're like, I don't want to do it anymore. No, that's yours now. You can have it. Or the okay, front. Okay, so full disclosure. Um, Disclose. We had our first, like, real like. Bro tiff. Broman. Our bro tiff. I said we almost broke up. Oh. <laughs> no, we didn't. We didn't. No. Um, but we did set we did set some boundaries, basically. However, <laughs> um, however, I think we came to to a kind of agreement where we we, uh, we both want this park to be really good, mm -hmm. and we both want to play on each other's strengths. Uh, he built an invert. Um, he built Go a few inverts, actually. <laughs> oh God, yes. Well, again, in the build video, um, no, that's not true. The build video, I cut out most of them. Mm -hmm. So, but yeah, like I proved in one of my episodes, my building is a process. I build things two, three, four times before I finally settle on something. And this was yeah. no, this was no um, exception. So mm -hmm. go ahead, continue. Yeah. Um, and, and I got involved because it was fairly high level planning. Um, and whenever we have some high level planning, we like to do it um, like a joint venture. Yeah. Um, like, like when it comes but... to layouts and stuff like that. I don't know when to say enough. If I want you to stop, like maybe we should have like a safe word or something. You know what I mean? What are you talking about? I just say, instead of saying stop, I just say the word. Like what? Well, Lisa and Bryce have one and I know. Like, <gasps> how about cacao? You don't know when to just <laughs> so... let me play. I play being play. the play being the key word because after all, this is a game. This is mm, 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 not really. Uh, not when we really. not with not with you. It's not no clearly. Cacao. Yeah, we've got we've got it. We've got a heal here. Heal to the public. <laughs> yes, heal. Open um, wounds. Yeah, so They're we just deep. Look, kind of set some boundaries a little bit. Be like, um, don't fuck with my shit. Pretty much. Cacao. Uh, we were working together on this coaster, and it got to a point where. Okay, well, that's going to have to re be, be rebuilt. And well, we, while you're doing that, this is going to have to change, too. And it got to mm -hmm. a point where I said, well, then you just fucking do it. <laughs> well, you didn't. You, you resisted. You're like, oh, well, okay, well, you do it, but I'm not going to use it. That's what I said. I said, you can do it, <laughs> but I'm not going to use it. <laughs> to be fair, I think it's because... <laughs> this is going to sound so douchey. I'm waiting. Go on. <laughs> <laughs> yes. 
I had a I had a certain vision that I wanted to to get out, and I'm sure you did too. Um, but what, from what I was seeing, the vision just wasn't it wasn't getting there. Once I got the layout completed, I did send it to you for tweaks, mm -hmm. and you did tweak it. Yeah, I had to do a whole bunch too, because once you change like one piece of track, no, and that's where the frustration set in. I didn't mind tweaking, but like. It started with, was it the, the drop? Trying to reshape the drop. I think it was the Immelman first. No, it was the drop. And then once you sit, what got me is, as we're working on the drop, you say, well, you know, the Immelman just has to be rebuilt anyway. It had to, yeah. And that's where I did it, a, well, then, F it all. Cacao. I'm like, I'm not cacao. I'm not, I'm not going to cacao. I'm not going to park cacao. I'm not going to... Anyway, <laughs> it's been resolved. I'm cool. We're cool. We're good. And then play, and, 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 and the whole playing with strengths thing, one of Mike's strengths is um, fiddling. He's a... T <laughs> he lo no, no you, you like to tinker. You like to do... Yes. You, you're in between me and Ryan. Yeah. Like, I, I am, am the big picture guy. Ryan is the uber detail. Let's go put a rubber mat down behind our stand. <laughs> You're somewhere in between that, which is why yes. we work well. So, and then you get Ryan on and he schools us. But anyway. Mm -hmm. so, yeah, yeah, and I just, I just wanted to bring it up because um, we were talking about, or we were having an open discussion about, you know, how social media kind of makes you a caricature of yourself. Mm -hmm. Um a lot of like let's play or YouTube videos. This is, I think, a discussion we had at uh, Shy Guys World. But um, yeah, that was that was like real kind of. I I kind of pissed him off, and it was it was a different type of of moment for us. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was it was a all right. Well, I'm just gonna go and eat some cake. I think is what I said. <laughs> that probably did help. Yeah, the, uh, the, it wasn't. No, it helped. didn't. It wasn't. It wasn't very good cake. Oh. It was okay. It was okay. Was but it, it homemade cake or was no, it? Uh, no. It was okay. Buy store bought cake. It was for one of Susanna's work friends' birthdays or oh, something. Oh, it was I office don't. cake. That's no good. School cake. Cacao. I'm oh, sure yeah, yeah, anybody yeah. that looks at it will know. It's very Alpengeisty um mixed it's kind of Alpengeist meets Raptor. Kinda of had a baby. Mm -hmm. That's mm -hmm. what I would say. So And the Definitely. name is going to be Peregrine. Peregrine? Is that mm -hmm. how you say it? Peregrine, I think, yeah. Yeah, um, you mentioned colors. I don't know how close I got to them. You got really dang close. Feel free um, to fiddle with those some more. I don't oh, know. I will. No, I'm sure you will. Yeah. On your build week, I started messing with, like, support structures and stuff like that. It's like, this just has to be custom supported. In yeah, the, oh, the coast the supports are awful. Because I'm, it's... I'm over them. <laughs> There's some people not... starting to custom support coasters, and I look at it, and I say... That's a lot of work, but then I say, but God, does that look so much better. Yeah, and I think if we are, uh, we're serious about this design, um, I think it's an awesome design. I think it needs to be sunk in a little bit, and we'll work with terrain to kind of make it uh, mm -hmm. disappear a little bit. Yeah, and I, but, did, uh, I did move it from its original spot, but it's fine. Mm, um, mm -hmm. It's much closer, but now I think it might be too close. But anyway. Uh, it might be a little close. This is what Sorry, you saw. You, go for it. You saw this. Um, the I red, did. like you had hands-on experience with the coaster, the other I stuff did. you didn't. So why don't, yeah, why don't we start poking at that? So it looks like the bathroom's finally gone, which, oh my God, thank God. <laughs> yeah, I got rid of that real quick. <laughs> Replaced with, oh, that's cool. It's like a coffee shop. Yeah. We've got Fo street Fox coffee. My goal Sweet. here was to begin our transition into another theme. Mm -hmm. So yeah, that's, you Which know, is, I think your strongest point and thank God you get to do it and I don't have to think about it. <laughs> <laughs> so I want and, your, go ahead. Oh, no, go ahead. I want your opinion on the chairs because um, on the chairs, yeah. oh, on these little, the red and black chairs. <laughs> I was trying. That was my first chair I ever built. <laughs> I was it trying is, so hard. It's kind of a chair. It's it's not bad actually. It's not great, but it's not that good. The problem is the the headrests are way too thick. <laughs> yeah, they're a little big. It's there. I love the super tall chairs. <laughs> well, no, no, those are those are floating. To be fair, <laughs> if you put a person next to those, it'd be like two and a half people. <laughs> sure. So anyway, let's go back to the actual park now, because... All right. 
so I see, yeah, you're kind of bringing it down a little bit. Um, it's definitely not nearly as detailed as the oldest part of the park, which is great because cool. I think that is legitimate. Excellent. Um, looking at uh, what Ryan did compared to what you did. No. I love the restroom sting. Look at that. Oh, wait, did you see the faux interior? I tried to do a faux interior on the coffee shop. Oh, you did? Mm-hmm. And it's just supposed to be a bar. It's just uh, that there's a bar with some stools in there. And then oh, cool. careful wall placements. Oh, that's that's very clever. Because um, I wasn't... empty. Yeah, you, you throw something in there, but I didn't want to build a whole interior like I did for my park. Um, all right, so I'm at the restrooms now, and it mm-hmm. looks like um, it looks like it's inspired by my really small little shack. Mm-hmm, very much but it's so. it's a lot nicer. It's a Thanks. lot nicer. <laughs> again, nice. pulling some of the stone detail from mm-hmm. the Emporium, but again, trying to transition into a little bit more modern vibe. I like that. Actually, and to be fair... That the next building, the one with the little staircase here, I don't know what you're looking at. Are you like, yeah, I'm, I'm heading towards monkey business. Baby. Yeah, monkey, <laughs> monkey that's business, baby. That's it's, a sign. That's I awesome. realized I didn't complete it. So, anyway, monkey business bakery. That's awesome. This is the first truly new building, mm-hmm. new theme. We've entered a new theme here. And we, what is this theme? Um, at first, it I did a lot of googling. Um, I looked at, uh, there's a city, and it's totally <laughs> random. It's called Beatrice. Beatrice, okay. uh, Nebraska. It's, uh-huh. it's on some two-lane highway on our way back from my, from my in-laws. We okay. drive through it at like 4 in the morning, and it's always Christmas time. And they have all these, and there's this one intersection with a stoplight. It's a fairly sizable town, and they have this old-school Main Street. And I was like, oh, we can totally do something like that. And so that was my first idea. Okay. Then I was like, I'm not sure that's going to work because it was when I started looking at it, I'm like, this is pretty run down because it's <laughs> the middle of nowhere, fucking Nebraska. Yeah. Um, so then I was like, okay, well, what else is kind of cool? Well, Galveston, there's a, uh, the I- Galveston Island down here just south of Houston. It's like, oh, well, there's, um, there's the Strand, a historic district that has a lot of, um, a lot of sh- shop storefronts and old brick architecture. I was like, I'll do that. And I looked at that and I was like, "Eh, that looks a little too ornate for this park and doesn't seem to fit. So then Mm -hmm. I just kind of combined the two ideas and I started, I said, fuck, I'm just going to start building. So I built this little bakery. I knew I wanted brick on top and like clapboard or shop on the bottom. And it kind of built itself. My idea here is we're in some sort of old timey main street but it's been mm-hmm. it's been revitalized at least once. Okay. And so that's kind of why the overhang here has the cables that kind of screams like 50s or 60s. And mm-hmm. that's also why the signage is kind of like that. But then some of the other buildings might have a bit older vibe to them. Cool. So that's my plan. That's kind of what I was... That's what I settled on. None of these buildings are directly... Well, except for the last one that you're going to get to. Um, okay. none, none of the buildings are directly influenced by anything else. This is all just kind of the mind of me. Mm-hmm. And that's that. I mean, it's it's really well put together. Um, I'm just kind of looking over the bakery right now. and it's mm-hmm. um, It's got kind of like all the details that you need for it to not look like a box with... Well, my okay. boxes. my 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 um the thing I like the most about it is it's not a square. Mm-hmm. It's actually like that you it's, have that little it's, diagonal. It's three custom oh. structures. <gasps> oh, you took a little um yeah, you took the idea from Ryan maybe? I just figured well if the street isn't it's not a straight street here. So the building not, would be, yeah. the building would not be a perfect cube. So it's not. It's off centered on the one it's not a perfect angle on the side with the little planter which was a total last minute addition and i don't like it <laughs> yeah i'm just gonna delete, ignore delete, that delete, delete, <laughs> delete, delete. <laughs> um and then the next thing so i didn't actually get to see any of this no so that's just totally Those are really just... tough tables <laughs> <laughs> they're high tables <laughs> Oh, I did okay. I did not have a person there. My thought is the table should. I'm gonna get an animatronic. Hold on. No, no, no. Get a get a get a uh, mechanic or a janitor. Okay. 
Where's Let me hire somebody just for I got one. No, they're in there. All right. Oh, it's actually not that bad. No, that's about as I tall mean, as it should be. Yeah, they're a little tall still. They're they're supposed to be like high tables and high chairs. <laughs> Maybe. Oh, I like that's them. Super- they look good. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> hey, it's okay, more than two patio. GD buildings, okay? Okay, okay, okay. Let's let's go to the things you did well. <laughs> I hate when you say that. Because that means you've got like 30 things that I didn't do well swimming around in your head. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. Um, Hop head bar and patio. This building looks awesome, too. It's like a little, bit more, um, a little bit more of a classic... Yeah. I don't know what you would call that style. Okay, and um, I've realized I am just a chameleon. Um, here's my inspiration. Actually, my inspiration are other builders. That's my inspiration. Mm-hmm. Um, what is his face? Flying Dutchman 7 on Shy Guys World has his Pendleton theme park. Uh-huh. And he has a lot of this classic architecture. <laughs> what? I found the Easter eggs. <laughs> Oh, did you? <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> what do you think of those? <laughs> I love its cucumber vodka. Give the IPAs. Oh, your sign is awesome. Which one? The Mass Bandit one. Oh, it's actually a... You don't want to know how long that took me to do. <laughs> it probably took you a long time because it looks awesome. Yeah, and then yours, it's supposed to be like the like the circle. is supposed to be a cucumber. I, I kind of caught that. But I didn't put, like, seeds in. I had to be too on the nose because there's a dark circle right on the edge. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so that was my... <laughs> well, you could have done what you did with the eyes in here to make the cucumber seeds. I could have, but, you know, to be fair, the circle part was a total last-minute addition. <laughs> That's freaking awesome. Yeah, I thought it was, I thought you'd appreciate that. <laughs> I was like, what are these signs? These signs are... Co- Oh. <laughs> so anyway, back to the front because I never right. finished my story. Gotta go back to the boring front now. <laughs> and so then we get to the biggest thing, which <laughs> is a theater. Well, that's actually <laughs> supposed to house. I mean, that's going to house an actual. Well, we're going to pretend it houses a theater. By the way, the gray brick on the left uh, next to the theater. Apologies uh-huh. for that just being there. Yeah, we're just going to delete that. <laughs> <laughs> Go for it. But I wanted I wanted the garden to be flanked by building. Okay, I understand that. So that was why that's like that. And then I just never got around to doing anything. And then I said, well, screw it. We need the theater. Mm-hmm. So that's my theater. That's cool. It's Now yeah, that it's... is influenced after a real image. I can't tell you where it comes from. Okay. I just Googled What's... Main Street Theater uh-huh. and picked a picture that was pretty. Okay. And that's what I came up. And that is basically it. Oh, you just don't know where it is. No. So what's all this on here? What is it? <laughs> Neckar Park, Wonder World, Trade Winds. What Expo is all 1898. that? 1898. Wait, what was Expo 1898? Isn't that heth 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 heth? <laughs> So all of these, and you're on there, and I'm on there. Oh, but you didn't like do my signature park. You did. I know the weird one. <laughs> That's right, Bish. <laughs> Why do you get top billing for your biggest, awesomest park, and I get? Oh, you want me to change it to Terra Mundi? <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna change it right now. Actually. You won't. Nope, you can't because you gotta move shit. And good luck getting it back into place. This is happening. <laughs> well, go ahead and change it. But Good. if you don't know, all of these are parks. Um, I got it. The only one that... Ah, uh, you suck. What did, did you change it to Terra Mundi? Terra Mundi. Ah, can you at least make it um, like Horizons? Okay. Or what are some of them? Ooh, Grizzly Forest. G Fab is what it's gonna be. <laughs> no, it can't be G Fab. <laughs> That's wholly inappropriate. G Fab. <laughs> oh no! How do you say Silverette's Park? I don't know. Is it a Dutch word or is it just nectar without a T? <laughs> <laughs> Necker. <laughs> Ne- Nekar Park, Nekar Park. Okay, well, that one's by Silverette Expo, mm-hmm. and I apologize, uh, Heth, 
F F if you F F F I apologize. I apologize if you're watching this and I got the year wrong, I guessed. <laughs> that's that's Baron eighteen ninety eight. What's his? I don't know, but I don't think it's that. Oh, I'm sorry. Right, and then I'm wonder that sign too. it's gonna be Baron eighteen ninety eight. No, it's gotta be a park by Heth. F Oh, you know what it should be? It should be his like Doctor Who. That was always that Journey was Through Time. Me. Right, Doctor Journey. Who, right? I don't know if Journey Through Time will fit. <laughs> Anyway, that is, these are all creators that have frequented Shy Guy's world and that have inspired me, or hopefully Mike, in one way or another. What did you write? Journey through Tim. <laughs> Isn't that an exhibit at Ep Epcot? <laughs> Journey through Tim. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay, if you're offended, blame Mike. <laughs> you suck. Anyway, um, one more public service announcement here. Uh, we've gone ahead and we've decided to further deepen ourselves in the mire that is social media. <laughs> yes. We <laughs> and have. Well, you have. Yes. Oh, I have. Because Mike edits all these videos, I have said I will, I will carry the cross of the social media um, <laughs> liaison for Brocoaster. Mm -hmm. And so there is an official Twitter. It's not a Brocoaster Twitter. It's my Twitter. And it's at... <laughs> it's my Twitter. It's mine. <laughs> well, there will be other things, but all Brocoaster info will be found on my Twitter, which is brand spanking new. Like, it's, it's pretty... It's, it's great. It's, oh, my God, it's so great. Um, <laughs> follow at MassBandit102, I, mm -hmm. I think. I think that's what it is, yeah. I hope. <laughs> you don't follow. I don't. I don't. You do no, whatever you want. You'll do, get. Do you might you... like if you follow. You might get um, a couple sneak peeks. Mm -hmm. That's we our do goal. We plan on doing that. Yeah. We plan on doing sneak peeks of the stuff we're working on, like on that day. Because remember, mm -hmm. we've recorded this a couple weeks before it actually hit. Mm -hmm. So if you want to see where we're headed, uh, Twitter. At MassBandit102. Well, I'm glad you liked what I built. And um, I can't wait to see how you take it in the next episode. So, for MassBandit. <laughs> and N7. This was Planet Brocoaster episode 16. Join us next time. Have a great week. See you later, guys. Bye-bye. Bye. 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 Thank you.